Good morning guys, another video right here. I am going to create the best coffee ever. <laughs> I'm going to make the best coffee. So I have here these coffees that I bought. We have Peru Geisha. I have the Sirius, another coffee from Ethiopia. I do have Pink Bourbon from Ecuador. I do have Hava Malibu from Colombia. This is wow, really, really good. One of my favorite. And we have the Rwanda Red Bourbon. So let's get to it. What I am want, what I want to do for the coffee today. I think I'm going with the Colombia, the Hava. So let's get all back here. And we are going to use some products right here to grind the coffee. We are going for the time more new grinder, manual manual grinder. Um, this coffee grinder, it's really, really, really good. Um, one of the, I mean, for the price, I think is one of the craziest uh, grinders in my humble opinion. Um, we are going to do 15 grams of this coffee and let me just set up the um, camera right here so you can see me how I do this. Um, yeah, so let's get a little bit a better angle right there. Perfect. So what we are going to do, check this out, going for the 15 milligrams right here from this Hava. Let's go. Wow, the smell, it's incredible. Perfect. And then we are going to get the hot water. We need a little bit more water here. So we are going to pour some more water right here. All right, perfect. And yeah, here we have the Hario server and the time more there you have it the time more kettle so let's go with the origami with the origami v60 and we are going to add a filter for this coffee from no other than Hario. Yep, we are going to wet this, make it wet, this filter. All right, perfect. Perfect. And we are going to grind this 15 grams of the Hava Malibu Colombia around 15 to 20 seconds of grinding right here so pretty quick honestly and this is my morning coffee before going to the gym all right there we have it Let's all right. Let me just show you how I pour this coffee right here. Check it out. Oh my god, it smells incredible! <laughs> smells really, really good. All right, 
so let's store this time more we store it right there perfect and these coffee beans oh my goodness smells incredible so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to pour the water i'm going to create some circles around here so basically i'm starting from the center and i'm going to pour in a spiral spiral okay so let me just show you so we have the 14.7 grams right there we are going to pour 250 milliliters of water so let me just show you how i pour this first we're gonna step on this button right here and now the time is going i'm starting to pour the first bloom for 50 grams of water and i'm trying with this 50 first grams to get wet all the coffee right the first bloom we're going to wait until 20 seconds and we are going again this time we are going in circles again and we are trying to get all the coffee beans wet and we are going to pour slowly in the center until i finish the 250 milliliters this should be around uh let's say two minutes extraction so yeah to 40 to 50 done all right and here we have this extraction is going pretty well actually um looks amazing the extraction was uh, pretty well done to be honest can't complain right there can't complain right there yep 140 all right a little bit faster i think it's because the coffee beans had was sitting for a little bit lower uh, longer a little bit still dripping but i think the coffee beans they sit for like two months and they are not in perfect condition but let's taste it so let's take this oh it's burning damn oh it's burning all right oh. <laughs> things happen if you don't have if you didn't drink the coffee yet <laughs> sometimes you hit yourself so yeah let's get this coffee and let's see how good it tastes all right so this is my pre-workout routine before going to the gym this is the morning coffee and oh actually smells very good yeah let's see all right all right all right for two months coffee not bad wow smells very good actually i love the coffee when it's freshly um uh when it's freshly um toasted so usually i consume this uh, beans around one month but i changed my house now i'm recording from another house in romania bucharest and i had to move all the um uh, not the furniture but all my clothes and stuff so yeah and i also had to create another setup right there where is my desk with everything in my new house 
in Bucharest, Romania. So yeah, let's test this coffee and let's see the quality of this coffee. Ooh. Okay, so the same coffee, I tried it when I just got it was one week and a half after they toasted and to be honest, it was having an incredible, incredible taste. Now, after two months, I noticed that it lost power, it lost flavor, it, lost, it has lost um, in taste intensity. It's not bad for two months and a half, I think. Two months and a half coffee. Two months and a half old coffee. It's not bad, honestly, but of course it lost. Uh, it has, has lost the, the, the intensity, the power. Hmm. Very nice. All right, guys, today I'm going to hit in the gym, legs, I'm going to hit legs, I'm going to hit shoulders. Whew, it's going to be a hard day in the gym, so um, getting ready to hit that gym. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video. Let's go.